Okay, guys, I'm back. It's the next morning. I am going to um, apply this wig, and this is a wig from RPG Show. This is the CSLS 003-S. It is the Kim Kardashian wig, and it is 16 inches in length. Uh, the color is, uh, what color is this? 1B, but it's more like, well, it's 1B. Color is 1B. Um, it's 16 inches in length. The cap construction is a cap 3 glueless cap, which has uh, the three combs in the inside and the adjustable elastic strap in the back. So that's how the cap is constructed. Um, the size, the cap size is a size one, which is a small and it's still too big for my head. So I got it uh, fastened all the way to the limit here in the back. Now actually these little things broke. Hmm. All right. So this came a loose and I haven't even worn it yet. I don't like that. Maybe I got it too tight. But anyway, um yeah. So anyway, this is one of their stock wigs. Um like I said, it's 16 inches in length. I really like the wig. The wig is very pretty. It's very pretty. Well constructed wig. The only thing that I see that I have an issue with is um, my head is much smaller than the smallest size that they have. So if I was ordering a wig from them, I probably would have to get a custom wig because my head is much smaller. But then again, um, I could probably create a notch in this wig to make it smaller. And maybe I'll do that some other time, but I'm not going to do it this morning. Um, and uh, this little part of the wig, the band in the back that you attach a little hook to, it came loose here. So I'm going to have to figure out, I'm going to have to take this hook and hatch it to the, uh, attach it to, the, to this one. I hope it doesn't come loose. So, all right, I'm going to work it out. So I'm going to go ahead and put this thing on. I do have a, oh, they sent me in the box, they sent me a, a wig cap and a brush um, for the wig. Um, the brush has the round tips so that you won't snag your wig. And they sent me a wig cap. And once again, this is from RPG Show. My very first lace wig. I am excited. Oh, the, la the lace color is uh, medium brown. And the bleach, the, the knots are not bleached. I won't be bleaching the knots. I will just, you know, work it out with using some type of makeup or something like that to camouflage it. So here we go. I'm going to try this. I'm going to go ahead and put on my wig cap, my stocking cap. And what I think I'm going to do, guys, is I am going to, what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to go ahead and put some got to be glued on here. I need to get my butt on the work. I'm going to use some got to be glued and I'm going to put it behind the hairline. I'm going to put some got to be glued hair gel right here in my party because I am going to adhere the stocking because I'm going to cut, cut that stocking because of this band part. I don't want that to show. And I saw um, Nisha Monet do this. So I am just following her technique. And hopefully it will work for me. I saw her do a uh, lace wig behind the hairline. And it was gorgeous. So I'm going to try to mimic what she did. But this wig is, you know, like I said, the cap on the wig is too big. But I'm going to work it out. I'm going to work it out. Whew. So I'm going to go ahead and let this dry. I'm going to uh, apply the stocking and I'll be back when it's time to apply the wig. First time trying this so I'm going to add some got to be glue right here. It's probably not the best application but I'm going to try. Okay like I said this is my first wig. I really think the wig is a beautifully made wig. I would love it if it worked out for me. So. Okay. It's not 
not totally dry, but it's dry enough. Now I got my unit. I'm gonna put it on. And it's supposed to be a center part, but I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it to the side. Now I have on my scarf. I'm going to leave this scarf on for probably, I don't know. I'm not going to be able to leave it on for an hour. But I'm going to leave it on for probably a good 25 minutes. Um, because I have to get out of here. But And I'll come back and show you guys um, the wig. Like I said, I really like the wig. I, I like the hair. It looks very natural. It's very well constructed. Um, the only issue that I'm, I'm having with the wig is the size of the wig. It's much too large for my head but I can work around all that I mean I can figure out how to make it fit my head better but I, I'm just pressed for time this morning so I'm not going to be doing that on this video um, and I'll come back at another time and show you what I came up with as far as um, having it suit my head size a little better but I think what I'm going to do today is I may um, I may just stitch it down in the back just for some extra security, I don't want it. I don't wear wigs, you know, traditional wigs. So I'm I'm not very comfortable with having on a wig. I'm scared it might fly off if I got my sunroof open or them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna probably stitch down the back and stitch it down on the sides, just for that added security. Um, after I wait for this to adhere. All right, and I'll come back and show you guys. But I'm liking it. I, I like the length. I think it's very natural looking. I've been wearing a lot of long hair. I think this this length of hair is very natural looking. If you're looking for something um, that's not too much of an attention getter, um, but draws the you know a very subtle subtle attention, um, this length is awesome. This is a great length. I always liked this length um, of hair. I know you guys been seeing me rocking the twenties. But I used to be a 14, a 12, 14, 16 inch girl. Okay. And I still love that length. I think it's very, very becoming. So guys, I will be back to show you this RPG show wig. Um, when I am totally done with uh, the adhering and the stitching it down process. Okay. Be back. Okay, guys. I have, <clears throat> I'm finished with the wig. I, just, I didn't really adhere it. Adhere it. I just used some hairpins stuck some hairpins in it like around here and this is what I came up with I really really like it it's very natural looking um I don't have it adhered down Camera. I don't have it adhered down in any way I didn't do any eyeshadow or anything I just have on my wig cap um there's the parting I just kind of comb my hair up into the wig just to kind of camouflage it a little bit because I'm not doing a defined part so I like it I think it's very natural looking so um, this is the RPG show wig the Kim Kardashian um, wig that's C this stock wig CSLS 003-S and this is her I didn't do a lot of styling to it I just threw a couple of quick curls in it with my flatter and I didn't really style it so um, you will be seeing this wig again but I wanted to show you this this is my first ever ever full cap wig and it's a lace wig and I really like it I like it so I'm, I'm opening up guys I'm opening up to some different experiences and I'm I must say you ladies who rock the lace wigs y'all rock it well um, I'm learning I'm learning so I'm going to wear this today and um, see how things go. See if anybody says anything. Maybe they might think I took a weave out. I don't know. We'll see. But this is her. I'm going to turn around. And it's very bouncy as you can see. Very bouncy. So I will talk to you guys later. Once again, this is the RPG show stock full lace wig. The Kim Kardashian, which is uh, their stock 
number CSLS003-S. Take care, guys. Bye.